So let's see. I'm not even gonna like buff them and all of that. Nah, maybe I should, huh? Just do it correctly, Zule. Do it correctly. Mm, my, you think I'm I'm peaceful? Call it. Show me your birthday suit. <laughs> So I'm just gonna lightly buff this. These are for me, so it doesn't really matter if it's all good and shit, but my husband said he ain't giving me money for your class. I'm paying it myself. Oh no. Divorce alo. Divorce his ass. Be like, okay, well cook for yourself. I just kidding, I ain't trying to start no fight between y'all. Um, if you're making like press-ons or well yeah, pretty much press-ons, yes, you need to buff the nails, girl. What you been doing? Because if you're gonna put acrylic, I mean gel, you have to buff them so it could stick the best. You don't need your you don't want anything to be um chipping off or anything like that i'm not really gonna wear them wear them like out but i guess i need to buff something just so that you guys can learn you know can you use nail primer as a buffer for the tips um i i don't know man i normally use it inside not on top Or no, chaca chaca, fuck, for real, que curso estás dando? Voy a dar una clase en marzo. Um, voy a subir los detalles, um, el, a ver, today's Thursday, Friday, a lo mejor mañana o el sábado les subo los detalles. Yeah, I don't use gel either, I'm learning, so we're learning together. I've been learning little by little about gel and what to do and what not to do and shit like that. So don't worry, girl. I got you. So I'm going to be using number 122. It is a transparent um, red. It is so sexy, honey. So let's see. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm going to do... Um, I'll do this one. All right, I'll do these two red. Um, Yes, space is limited. The space that I'm going to be in is not large at all. So I can only fit like 12 people. 12 hoes. 12 hoes, maybe. Mm, pushing i mean i've squeezed like 22 before but i'm not sure if i want to do that again because of covid and all of that so i'm gonna be doing this whole nail red i'm gonna do this one also Yes, girl, 12. The salon is not big at all. Hi, Zule. Hi, everyone. Hello. Today, we're going to do some bomb ass flowers. I'm just going to do these first because they are not flowers at all. We're going to do some Valentine without the Valentine. You know, like you can wear them any time of the year. Call in, girl. What do you mean call in? Hold on. Let me put these in here. Cooking in the lamp. As soon as you post, I'm buying the ticket with PayPal because I see you accept PayPal. Okay, I'll, I'm... um give you guys the details um what color was i gonna use this one in a day or two my landlord already responded to me 
They told me I could do it. Now I just have to work out the flyer and the details. But instead, aquí ando en el live. Chismeando. So this one, I'm just going to paint halfway. Oh, um, I forgot to show you guys the color. This is rubber base number one. No sé cómo usarlo para que duren los cristales. Que el glue. ¿En qué lo aplicas? ¿En gel o en acrílico? Ok, ok. I'm going to do this. Oh, shit. Did I touch it? I'm going to do this one also. So we're going to have some matchy, matchy situation here. I'm going to do Frenchies with some flowers. They're going to look so cute. Me, I didn't like Frenchies before. And look at me now. Look at me now doing Frenchies in every life. What's the rubber base? Um, This is a thicker gel. So instead of um applying a base coat like normal, this gel is mixed. It has a base coat and it's thicker than normal gels. So it's mostly for like manicures. Or like perfect for press-ons or people that do gel extensions. You can use them for different things. But they're more to give you like the strength on the nail. So if you a gel person or whatever. Like you do manicures. um, These are nice. Because you don't have to do a base coat. Is in it already. All right, I'm gonna take those out. This nude one is the only one that's a rubber base right now. Let me stick my nails in there. I'm gonna give it another coat because we, I mean, I want it kind of transparent, but I need it a little bit more, um, more deep and rich. And Toxica. Toxica. Oh my god. This Instagram be a little sad. Look at we only have 93 people. Where is everybody at? Where y'all at? But it's okay. At least, at least we got an Instagram. At least we got somewhere to go. Mira, ya las corría la verga. Más chingón. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's up with me liking red all of a sudden. Like, I'm not a big fan of red. Pero como que ahorita sí me está gustando el red. Pinche Zule, ya tengo sueño. Y hay muchas... Muchas tóxicas. Me tienes hablando mexicano. <laughs> Sí, vas a ser Mexican, honey. Bien mexicana vas a salir de aquí tú. Vas a decir, vale verga. Vete a la verga. Esa es mi palabra favorita. My mom be like, ¿qué? ¿Qué dijiste? No digas eso. I'm like, mother, be quiet. Is a yolk. That red is beautiful. Oh my god. Hold on. Let me zoom in. I'm over here thinking y'all zoomed in and shit. But no you ain't. Toxica. A todas las que les gusta el rojo. Son una bola de toxicas. ¿Quién dijo yo? I used to be toxic when I was young. Now I just don't care. Just joking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I yeah, I guess I was a little toxic too. Mm 
Me too, me too. I love that red. It's cute, huh? I didn't even know I had it. I was on live earlier. But before I went live, I um I was putting away my gels. I bought these containers at uh, Costco. The ones that are like clear for like your refrigerator or just for whatever you want. So I was like, hmm, what the fuck should I do with them? I'm like, I'm going to take them to my nail room and use them to store my stuff, right? <sighs> Can't buy none on this page. What, what are you trying to buy, girlfriend? Where are your badges? Oh, no, this page doesn't have badges. I don't know why. Um, so I was like, let me put my stuff away. So I was organizing my gels and I'm like, ooh, this color's pretty. Ooh, this color's pretty. And that's how I'm over here live. So thanks to my organization that I was doing earlier, I found these colors and now I'm here to show you. Hold on, hold on. These comments are moving a little fast for me. Can you do ombre sets with gel or it's easier with acrylic? Um, I've never tried to do an ombre. Well, I'm lying. The first time I ever tried to do an ombre was in my class that I went to. Let me tell you, I did not do a very good job. I feel like it takes practice. But I prefer acrylic. Until I guess I get the hang of it, then maybe I'll like gel. But we'll see. Actually, I think this one I'm going to do on nude. I don't really know how to do ombre with gel. Um, I've seen people like just put two colors and then use a brush and kind of try to blend it in the middle. But my teacher or Helen... When I took my class, she had a specific brush and she worked it a whole other way. And then I seen people use sponges and shit in the past. Like, uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm down, if I'm down to do all of that. All right, let me put my red nails over here. I got a little dust in them, but fuck it. At least only in one. Fuck it, thug life. No más es para la foto. Easiest way is the airbrush for ombre. I heard that's pretty easy too. I need to try that method. So what are you guys doing? ¿Cómo se llama ese color? El nude? Es el rubber, rubber base one. Pero todavía no lo tengo en mi página. Lo tengo que subir. Yeah, your sets come out really good. Make it look so easy, but it helps me that you're left-handed. Show me how to hold things. Oh, okay, girl. Oh, like hold it. With, are you left-handed too? All right, let me get my black. I'm going to be doing my famous little roses from earlier. So if you guys missed it earlier, here it is again. I really want a picture of this, so I need like a full set. You can use an ombre brush, fan sponge, and even use acrylic powder for the ombre too. Okay. Uh, acrylic powder. All right, a ver, a ver, a ver. We're going to do a Frenchy nail. Wrong side. ¿Cuál otra página tienes para ver tus lives o oh, nomás aquí? Oh, shit. Esta está feita todavía. No, usualmente uso mi otra página, um, pero ahorita me bloquearon porque soy una mala niña pidiendo nudes. Oh, I'm, I'm good right here, huh? Me bloquearon en mi página, la normal, la regular. Okay. 
I'm cleaning up my nail area and packing boxes. Girl, why are you packing? Oh, shit. Hold on. I forgot to clean my brush earlier. It's all stiff. If your brushes are ever stiff, get some clear gel and wiggle it. And the little hairs will separate. Like that. I don't know why I have the Go Go Power Rangers. That song in my head. Girl, IG tripping. Mm hmm. Yo no te. Yo no te entiendo, pero me gusta verte porque enseñas muy bien. Ay, gracias. Deberías de venir a mi clase. Para que aprendas en persona. So I'm going to attempt to make my French like I've seen online. A ver si, 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 se. I'm not the best at French, okay? So don't judge. Don't judge me. At least not painting. I think people do some shit like this. Some bullshit like that. And then they go something like this. So si no saben hacer French, aquí les estoy enseñando como mire un video en el, en el Instagram. Ay, mira. Casi me salió bien. Normally, I just, like, eyeball it. Pero pinches ojos más chuecos que la verga que me cargo. Ahorita no mames. I should be sleeping because I work tomorrow, but you already know. Las uñas no pueden faltar. Fuck yeah, for real. Ahorita me está fallando mucho la vista, la verdad. Me duele mi cabecita y los ojitos. Pero una no quiere irse a acostar ni a dormir. Prefiere andar aquí en el mitad, eh. Me imagino, pero vivo en Ciudad de México. Ay, no. Will you ever do online classes? I always say that I might, but most likely I'm not. I'm not even, I shouldn't even be lying to y'all. I don't really like online classes. It's not the same. And then it's like, Work, extra work to respond to everybody who has questions about the class and mm, I'd rather just come live and talk to you guys you know you know what I mean Jellybean o te explico Federico okay a ver, let me check my French. What the hell is FT? I don't know what that means. Food stamps? I'm nah, just kidding. <laughs> Does that mean food stamps, girl? You're going to pay me in food stamps? I mean, this wood, this wood is kind of like an online class here. Yeah, I guess that's true. The, well, what I mean is the part that I dislike about having classes online is, okay, I'm going to announce the class and then a million and one people are going to message me, but only like one fourth are really going to take the class. So I don't want to do the extra work in responding to people that are not really interested, but they just be metiches, you know? You know what I mean? Like, girl, I'd rather be on live teaching y'all, my true followers over here, something, than texting other people that are just going to waste my time. And they're not serious because I get that so much. I've gotten it in the past where the class is like almost free y todavía se andan haciendo like Le estoy cobrando un huevo y mitad del otro. And it's like, dude, the class is free. Take it. Take it. You know? Have my fucking deposit. Girl, as soon as I ask for deposit, that's when I hear crickets. So that's why I'm like, mm, I'd rather not waste my time. Because people be like that. 
All right, I think I kind of like this method of French. So let's do this again. Like, I don't know. I'll think about it. Hey, girl, what I miss? Um, Not much, girlfriend. We just getting started. I don't know how far I did the other French, but they don't got to be even. They don't got to be even. Have them pay for us. You want to talk to me? You got to pay up. <laughs> you want to speak to the queen? Did you bring coffee? Then no. It's funny because earlier I was writing some information down for my class, right? And then Patrick goes like, do you get paid for that? Because I was telling him that I wanted to have a class. And he's like, do you get paid for that? And I'm like, yeah, Patrick. I mean, I do like to hang out with people. But I have to get paid too. It's a job. I'm a teacher, okay? No más que no fui a la escuela. I'm not accredited to be an actual teacher. Like, in an actual school. But I still got to get paid. Have... What that's all what I have to practice. Frenchies? Yeah, French is hard. It's a love and hate relationship here. It's a love and hate relationship. Like I swear when I do it on these fake hands, they come out bomb. Or the fake nails. But once I do it on a client, it's like a struggle because they move a lot. They sit all crooked sometimes. And it's like, I ain't about to fight with y'all. I ain't about to fight with y'all. Or it's just different. Just got the package a few minutes ago. Can't wait to use the metallic silver. Ooh, yes, girl. Oh, did I fuck up my Frenchie here? I mean, I mean. I'm not sure if I messed it up or it was messed up. A ver, a ver. A mover la colita. Yes, girl. You will get a certificate for the class. Because I know a lot of people love certificates. You will get a picture with me. Ah, just kidding. Unless you want to. Um, You're going to get fed. You're going to get a kit. And if you give me attitude, you're going to get slapped. Nah, just kidding. Nah, no, just kidding. Kidding, not kidding. There's always one person that that be that be almost getting slapped. Always. Damn, I think I did this one hella deep. So deep, bitch. It's coming out through the throat. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna have to do the other one deep deep too. It's sad because sometimes I don't remember what the fuck I said. And you guys are over here laughing. And I'm like, what the fuck did I say? Que es no busquen the old you for real. <laughs> nah, I wouldn't hit them. I kill them with kindness. That's my new thing, you know? I don't fight nobody or nothing like that. I kill them with kindness, honey. I kill them with kindness. All right, this one is going to be a little different. It's going to be. I don't know why I like slanted shit. I guess because you could not like fuck it up, you know? What did I say? Or are they laughing at me? Please answer the question about the mat. Um, hold on. What did you ask? The nail guru, where are you? Hi, Luigi. A ver, a ver. <laughs> where did you get your mat? Oh, this one? It's from Swaggy Tags Official. It's not your just 
regular matte, okay? It is heavy duty. Um, I'm trying to sound like a commercial over here. De las pinches trocas. Heavy duty. Withstand it all. Throw acetone, monomer. Nah, just kidding. I like it. Um, yeah, so you could get it at Swaggy Tags Official. And um, if you want to save some coin, girl, you can use Zule at checkout. Because I'm, I'm cool like that. They give it to me for my birthday. They give me the mat for my birthday along with a little code so I could share with my hoes. Because they know that y'all love to copy me. And eh, just kidding. But no, it's new. They barely came out with, a, with it this year. Pin the name again. Okay, hold on. It's called Swaggy Tag. Tags. It says it right here in the corner, so I'm just going to copy it. Official. Uh, all right. It is a little pricey, okay? Don't get scared when you see the price, but it's definitely an investment because it's going to save your fucking table. If you are tired of of fucking up your table with the acetone, the monomer, the glue, you need a mat in your life. Because you don't know how many tables I had to, excuse me, I had to go through already because I always ruin them. No mames. Once I dropped my whole bottle of glue, I had to buy a new table because it took a whole chunk off my table. Because it was from Ikea. So i rather, <laughs> I just got scared with the price. Wait, is it really acetone resistant? Yes, it is. I spilled acetone on it and monomer and it did not budge nothing. That's what I'm telling you. Like, I don't promote shit that I do not love, you know? Like, if I don't believe in it, I ain't going to tell you to buy it because I ain't about that life. I ain't trying to sell you shit that don't work. Um, but I'm telling you because I've always wanted something like this. Where the fuck did my... Oh, here it is. I've always wanted a mat. I never thought it would come this big, to be honest. Um, I normally, like in the past, when I pictured myself getting like a mat with my nails, I would just picture a fucking paper or a little sticker to put it in the background. So when I work... Um, my name could be there, but once I saw this in the box, when I opened it, I was like, oh my God, honey, I straight up came to my room and started doing nails on it. And the bottom part, it has like a foam-ish thing that doesn't slide. I think that's one of the, the things about it that I like the most because normally when I'm working at the salon, um, I hate that my stupid, the little pink towels that I use, they fucking move so much. And I always have to be pulling them back up and putting them under my armrest and all that bullshit. And it's just a pain in my ass. So I'm going to be taking this tomorrow to the salon and it doesn't move. So you won't make a mess everywhere. You know what I mean? I miss the beginning. Did you lay acrylic on them? No, this is um rubber-based gel. But they're going to be hard like fucking acrylics. Yes. All right, so. I'm just putting a second coat of black. Because it's not... um. I want it to be super, super dark. Let me just extend this a little bit. I feel like me preguntan one thing and then I go on and on and on and on and on. Like, I could keep talking for days. Okay. We back at it again. Yes, honey. We is. You work at a salon? Or you own your own salon. No, I do not own my own salon. I rent a space in a salon. I I rent a room. 
So I have like a little suite, I guess. A little room that's falling apart already. I've been there too long. Un, un cuchitril. Una... Mi changarrota chiquito. Okay. It's funny because, well, not funny, but on this Instagram, I have like a whole other, like a bunch of new faces that I never seen before. Like when I go live on my other page. It's like, hey guys, welcome. Welcome, welcome. We doing some cute nails today. Maybe my clients will get inspired and choose this for their nails. Um, what are you doing with these press press ons? I'm gonna keep them for myself. Um, oh shit! It, <laughs> I didn't pin it. I'm so stupid. Um, it's called Swaggy Tags Official. They're here on Instagram. I forgot I had to uh, pin it. Are you guys allowed to pin stuff for me? Thank you, Naughty Nails. I totally forgot. I wait, I wait. No. I got fucking dust on my nail. That's the one thing that I hate about fucking jail. Stay sticky. Me da gusto que te bloquearon allá porque así le estamos aquí por primera vez. Pudimos ver. Oh, sí. Pues sí, ¿verdad? No pensé en eso. Tengo nuevo público. Yeah. Es la primera vez hoy que me voy vivo aquí en esta página. Nunca he hecho un vivo en esta page. So I'm just gonna do my second coat. And this gel polish is number 20. It's the blackest black you ever see. ¿Por qué te bloquearon? Uh, me bloquearon porque soy chingona y no quieren que... Nah, just kidding. Me bloquearon por una pendejada. Es que yo subí una foto de unas uñas que son nude. Unas uñas nude, ¿verdad? Entonces yo puse en el caption, puse, mándame nudes. O sea, por el color que usé en las uñas, ¿verdad? Nude. Y me bloquearon porque di eh, dijeron que es sexual. Like, what the fuck? Ni estaba enseñando chichis ni nada de eso. La like, ya ni mi pinche pastel me bloquearon. Like, se pasan. Te pasas, Nico. It's good to have a backup. Yup. And now, I'ma have a backup on a backup. Okay, ahora, I'm gonna use my blooming gel. Blooming gel. And I'm going to apply a thin layer to the tip. Make sure whenever you use gel to try to do it as thin as possible. I'm just going to do it down here. Even though the French goes up higher because it's not like I'm really going to make it go that high. Just here. Up to wherever you put this gel is how far it's going to spread. Con el pastel hasta se les hizo agua la boca, ¿verdad que sí? Se les antojó, por eso me dio chorro. Eh, just kidding. Just kidding, bitch. So next, I'm going to use my gel polish 21, que viene siendo este blanco. Y voy a hacer unas flores, ¿ok? Esto lo hice hace rato, pero... Cuando ya me iba a ir, 
when I was going to log out, somebody came in and they're like, oh, can you do it again? And I'm like, girl, I'm leaving. But I came back. So here it is. Here's the video. And then also because I'm going to post it on YouTube. So win-win situation. So cuando you're using blooming gel, it expands your gel. So you have to kind of do this kind of fast. And it takes a little practice, okay? So si a la primera no te sale, a la segunda sí. Algunas veces tu flor va a parecer una panocha abierta. Pero es ok. Tu di es una flor como la flor. Que no nos van a bloquear. I don't be like, push my face into both cakes. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. One of my followers was like, girl, I wanted to sit on your cake. I was like, girl, good thing I didn't fucking invite your ass. If not, I would have had no cake. She would have ate that shit. She would have swallowed that with her cat. My girlfriend. If I ever have a party, I know what to give y'all. As a toy. You little hot dogs. I be having the most random songs in my head. And then over here, I'm going to do a smaller one. So one thing that I learned about this blooming gel is that if you put too much gel, it'll start to kind of like f fall, not fall off, but like it won't expand as it's expanding. It's going to start to come out on the sides. Oh shit. I forgot I didn't put blooming gel on here. All right, I'm just going to give it some time to finish spreading out so I can cure it in the lamp. Just a couple seconds. All right, let me put it in the lamp now. And this is the same gel that you use for, um, for like that crocodile shit that's popping right now well that song works if you're talking about cat for real Zuleita I'm gonna get blocked I don't think they understand Spanish they're gonna speak Spanish alright so I'm gonna do the same thing to this one but because this nail is a lot smaller to pinky nail, I'm probably not going to be able to fit the same amount of flower. So, let's see how this goes. Again, remember to apply thin. So, if you guys haven't got yourself a blooming gel, you better go get one. You're going to need it for several things. You know, you can use it for a lot of things. It's multi-use. You could use it for flowers. You could use it for that crocodile trend, trendy design. You could use it for um, marble or just infinite options. So I'm going to start here. I don't know why I always start there. You could start wherever in the nail you want. Just hurry up. I think out of everything in nails that I do, this is the only part I can hurry up in. Because I feel like I have to. Like a pura lip. Hola. Hola, honey. 
So, mismo que se me está secando a el otro, aquí voy a hacer otro pétalo. I'm just gonna make this flower fucking huge. Fuck it, take life. Oh, wrong color. Wrong color, honey. Wrong color. A little different, so I'm gonna give it some time. Ellos no saben por qué los latinos tenemos diferente dilecto de palabras y así nos tienen que bloquear a todos. Fuck, for real. I'm over here. I'm so stupid. I'm trying to air right. Like, girl, no, that's not the way it goes. All right, and what nail brush? This is the twin one. Um liner from my website it's called two-in-one liner zule you should do clear nails with the edges pink with bling Ooh, that sounds cute i don't even know what i'm gonna do on my next my next set of nails that's looking awesome flower thanks Yo soy en pendeja para las flores. No, mija. Pues entonces de veras tienes que venir a la clase porque voy a enseñarles cómo hacer flores. 3D, ok. 3D flower. 3D flower. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. Yes, I can't believe you're doing this type of flowers. Yes. Yes, girl. Yes. You're welcome. You're welcome, Kiki. A ver, hold on. I need more white. Oh my God, Diamond, your doggy's so cute. He looks like my, he or she, I'm not sure what your doggy is, but looks like my dog. I would say his name, but then I'm going to summon his ass and he's going to annoy me. He's going to be like, Mom, are you done? Like, Mom, are you done with your life? Like, are you going to play with me now? Oh, shit, I fucked up here. Put on the... Aquí hablando. Hi, crazy. You found me? She's Abby. Oh, it's a girl. How do you get her so puffy? I would love Lenny to be puffy like that. ¿Dónde vas a hacer la clase? Um, la voy a hacer en Los Ángeles porque ya me dieron permiso. En el salón de trabajo. Ya mañana o oh, el sábado. No, shit, los dos días trabajo. Pues voy a tratar de hacer um, mi flyer y lo subo cuando lo tenga listo este fin de semana. Con los detalles. Que no se lo pueden perder. Porque si se lo pierden. Pues ya valieron. I let her hair grow out. But she's a bitch on. My dog is too. But I can't get her hair to get puffy like that. Like. My dog gets puffy. But not that puffy. I tried brushing his hair with three different combs. Once, oh lord, that was so much work. He was puffy, but just from his forehead. Because that's all I did. <laughs> that's all I did. I got tired. It took me three hours. <sighs> okay, I'm going to let this finish spreading out is her video frozen or is it my phone someone replied because i don't have the volume on so my little can base coat or top coat be replaced for blooming gel no i don't think it does the same it will spread out a little bit but not like blooming gel 
your poodle is puffy. Alrighty. I'm going to put the same gel that I used earlier, number 122. Girlfriend, I came late. Can you repeat the info of what classes and what are you using for the Stilo? Um, I'm talking about a nail class that I'm going to be having, girlfriend. So we're just going to paint. Paint the flowers. And girl, look at them coming to life. Honey, it's her phone. Maybe try logging off and um, coming in again. So I attempted to do this with another color, pink, and is not the same as beautiful. I feel like it's prettier with dark colors. Maybe just red because roses are red, you know? Wow. Look at that. Can you guys see it? Oh my God. Right now we're going to give it some extra effect. Okay. Good night, Luigi. See you next time. All right. Let me do the next one. Let me paint the next one. Oh. Right? It like comes to life when you put the red on top. It's like, ooh, la la, honey. Like, oh my God. Oh my God. <sighs> oh my God. Let me clean my shit. Ahí está. Ay, mira, como la flor. ¿Quién dijo que no puedo pintar? Con el Blooming Gel, todas podemos pintar una puta rosa, ¿ok? Que nadie les diga que no pueden pintar rosas porque con el Blooming Gel se hace sola. Casi, casi se hace sola la güey. Always wondered how that was done. Thank you so much for the video. No problem. No problem, girlfriend. Baby Jesus sent me to lead you guys. Not just kidding. That's something that somebody told me the other day. Like, God sent you. I'm like, yes, he sure did. I think this is my calling because... I love nails, but I don't love it that much. I'd rather chat with people. Like, I like the cheese man more than the nails. If you catch my drift. I think I had to learn how to do nails so I could share my knowledge with other, other women. Wow. I don't know why, but this side one looks extra sexy i'm just trying to clean the sides thank you baby jesus this one came out a little lumpy i didn't clean the gel earlier oh well oh well good thing is for me and i am picky i mean do you recommend the resin spray after we use your bling adhesive? Yes, I do. Trust me. It's going to be your best friend. So I did this little technique earlier that I saw online where you put a little um, a little line of white and it kind of just makes it pop more. But you just kind of like outline the petal. Hopefully I don't fuck it up. You outline the ones you did earlier. Sorry, guys, if I cannot look right now, it's because estoy bien entrada aquí. We're like, ahorita se ve chistosito, pero van a ver, van a ver cómo va a quedar la flor. La mendiga.
It doesn't have to be like hella perfect outline. Pero pues por ahí. Pretty thin on the thin side. Right now it looks like what in the flying fuck are you doing? Girlfriend, I cannot send you my 19 pesos. Why? <laughs> Um, because this, <laughs> this, um, Instagram doesn't have badges. Don't worry. Tomate el cafecito con los 19 pesos for me, girl. Or una beer, whatever you can buy with that. I appreciate the tato. Um, does anyone know if I after you apply the primer to the natural nail, can you do a gel top coat on the nail and tip afterwards to help stick on chunky glitter or will the nail lift faster? What method are you trying to do? Are you talking about gel extensions? Okay, so y'all think this is funny, huh? It looks like una panocha abierta right there. Pero no, no, no. Ahorita van a ver. Ahorita van a ver lo que hicimos hace rato. Ay, wey. I be shaking like a chihuahua for these lines. Girl, I be shaking like a leaf too. But I gotta pretend like I know that I'm doing a good job. Watch me fuck these up. And then I have to do it again. We have to do it again. Um, For la crazy aquí porque llego tarde. Why can't we buy badges on here? I don't know. I tried to apply for it, but this this um Instagram of mine doesn't didn't let me apply for that. Maybe because I have two Instagrams, they're like, no girl, you can only do badges on one. I don't know. I would like to know also. Right, right. Um, hi Juju. Hi Juju Dom. Welcome my loyal followers to this other Instagram. They have me punished. Now I feel like Mimi when they punished her on El Instagram. ¿Cuál es tu otro Instagram para seguirte? Um, nomás Sulais Nails. Así como dice aquí, mira. Sulais Nails. En vez de Sulais Nail Shop, es nomás um, Sulais Nails. Mi otro Instagram es mi original. Este es para mi tiendita. Driving in a snowstorm watching this. You are crazy. You need to stop. You need to stop. I do not want to be responsible if you hit a tree or something. I just I don't even know. I don't even know where you live. I forgot. Zule just ordered a new distro book. Can't wait to try it. Okay, girl. Kiki, ¿por qué lloras? Whew. I'm almost done with this one. <sighs> Fucking shit, I mean, you swear you. Why did they punish you? Porque soy mala. I'm just kidding. Por una pendejada que yo no hice. Um, because Instagram is stupid. Yo subí una fucking picture and I put in the caption, send me nudes. Because the nails were nude. Right? Just a cute caption. And I guess they thought I was asking people for actual nudes. So, they blocked my ass for fucking asking for nudes. I mean, luckily, they didn't block my whole account. I could still post normal shit, but meanwhile, I guess they review it because I did ask to appeal it. Um, They don't want me to go live. So, I could stop. I won't be showing my chichis no more. 
my nudes. Which is ridiculous. Like, why would they not let me go live? Maybe so I don't get badges. I don't know. Um, How long will the lips last? I can't tag anymore. I don't know, girl. I have no idea. This is the first time it happens to me. And this never happened to me before. I hope not long because this is not fair. This is not fair. I need my full publico. I only have 83 people here. I feel like I'm talking to myself. Well, I am. But... I'm missing my other few little, little girls, little ladies. All right. So now that we did that little funny outline, we're going to put another coat of the red. And it's supposed to give us a way nicer look. Check it out. Check it out. Ooh, I love this side now. It's my favorite, right? It's so cute. Right, let's put this gel on top. Scroll up. I can't scroll up. Just type it again. I'm sorry. I'm in the middle of painting here. If you type something that I didn't read, just copy paste, please. Ooh, it's an illusion. Wow. Look at that, girlfriend. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? A second coat? I should be an actor. Like, girlfriend. No, hombre, si ya tuviera mis badges, ya hubiera juntado suficiente para no ir a trabajar mañana, ¿verdad? Pero no, pinche Instagram quiere jugar. Quiere jugar conmigo a la verga. Quiere que me quede pobre. Que no me den un badge ni mi dólar. Pues, it's okay. It's okay. I will be back. Ooh, la la. Let's see. Like that little white gave it a whole new vibe, huh? It's like it's 3D underneath. Thanks to whoever thought of that. I saw it on Instagram. La miré en el Instagram. I just need to make sure that it's nice and flat. And not lumpy. But girl, look at that. I feel like I could grab the flower. After you added the red on top, it looks so pretty, right? Second coat of red, ma'am. That's what the... Uh, you're crazy for real, girlfriend. Te hubiera mandado 40 pesos. I'm in love with this life. Okay, pues, ahí me los debes, eh? Ahí los voy a estar esperando cuando me desbloqueen. No es cierto. No es cierto, honey. No empieces, hueva. No empieces, por favor. Um, if for whatever reason you have like extra little gel like me over here, you could always file that little piece off right here. I don't know where that came from, or maybe it's been there and I just didn't see it when I filed my nail. When you're completely done, you could go in and buff that off. Oh my God. This is so cute. Oops. What did I touch? Excuse me, nails. I need space. All right, let's see what you guys are talking about. 
I love doing those. I did a long set, little set on my page. You should check it out. Okay, girl, prestige. They're sexy. Sexy, honey. Thank you so much. That's all I was trying to figure out. Oh, what what is she? What were you trying to figure out? Jaw extensions? All right, let me clean this up before I, I spill shit. What kind of red is that? Is un rojo translucido or normal red? You can do either one. They both work, but the effect is different. This one is un rojo dark red, like a jelly. Um, but if you use a normal red, it should still give you a nice effect. Pero pues, obvio que este es mejor because um, it's like a deep red. The mat is from Swaggy Tags Official. I'm going to put a top coat on this because I don't know if I'm going to put bling on it or not. I have not decided yet. But I'm going to do a shiny just in case I have not made up my mind yet. But I said un candy. Candy apple. Dice mi esposo que es un rojo perrón. Uh -huh. Yo le digo que es un rojo putona. Putona red. That's how my clients know. The red as putona red. It looks tasty, huh? Yes, honey. If you guys ask any of my clients, they're going to be like shook. Like, what the fuck? You're doing red nails, bitch. You're doing red nails. You don't like red nails. My sister will be shook, too. She likes red nails. Not me. Um, enséñanos cómo usar el glue para los cristales no se caigan. Ahorita, ahorita cuando termine estas, les voy a poner bling bling. Are these Euphoria inspired nails? Um, no, these are like Valentine's Day nails, but without the hearts. They're just florecitas. Lo iba a decir, pero no me dejó. <laughs> ¿Te bloquearon? Te bloquearon a ti también, amiga. Uh, miren, 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 miren. Okay, a ver, I'm gonna file the side a little bit. No, I should probably put the top coat first before all the dust gets stuck everywhere. Should I do these matte or shiny? What do you guys think? Did you teach your sister to adjust a little bit? Should I do them matte or shiny? Earlier, I think I did matte. Let me see. Oh, wait. This one doesn't have anything. So, this is what the matte one looks like and shiny. Should I do matte or shiny? Glossy. 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 Matte. It makes you want to bite into the nail so glossy. Ha, huh, it does look delicious. Shiny, shiny, nude matte. All right, this time we're gonna do shiny. My husband said one and one. No, 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 no. Dile a tu husband que vamos a hacer shiny porque el público decidió eso. No one and one. Maybe, maybe. Towards the end, I'll add some matte somewhere. I have been liking matte. Actually, I have three nails that are um, flowers, so we can't have one and one. That does not add up. I don't know why, but I feel like red and gold just makes everything extra sexy. So I think we're going to be adding some gold to this. 
I'm just gonna put these here so I can stick them all in here together. Hard to choose, right? I'm over here asking, but I'm still gonna do whatever I want. Just want to make you guys feel like you're part of the choice. <laughs> you know, my sister gets mad when I say that. When I do that, she's like, why the fuck are you asking me? You're not going to listen to me. And then I'm like, I don't know. Just going to go opposite, whatever you say. So I'm putting top coat and then right now I'm going to fix my shape. Because I am a little, there's like a little piece right there. I don't know where that came from, but it came from somewhere. Dice mi husband que van a ser uñas chiviricas. What? Chiviricas, he tripping. What the fuck is chiviricas? What does that mean? Chiviricas. No sé lo que es eso. Es, van a ser uñas chingonas. Chingonas. ¿Cómo se llama tu husband otra vez? Ya me has dicho una vez. Um, yes, I'm going to try to save it for my YouTube channel. Because I don't think I've done this tutorial yet for them. Honey, honey, honey. I swear there's always lint in here. Always. All right. So off you go to the lamp. To the. To the lamp, guys. Get in there. We. Casi se caen a la verga. All right. Meanwhile. Meanwhile, they cook. Let me find my bling. Let me put this over here before I drop it. We need to put a little bit dazzle dazzle. Because it ain't zule if it has no bedazzle. I'm going to try to keep it a little simple, but pues, I cannot promise anything. At checkout, is there a shipping fee? Yes, there is. Depending on where you live and what the weight is for your product is what the shipping fee will add up to. Hmm. When am I putting them on? Um, When I take these off. I'll probably take them off during the weekend. Only because I ya quiero una foto with um my press-ons. Okay, well, meanwhile, um, oh, yeah, I was going to put gold on it, huh? I'm going to choose between, I mean, help me choose, between light gold. Ooh. Should I do light gold? I mean, I'm going to do it with this one. Should I do light gold? Um, I normally don't do press-ons, but just for fun right now. When are you putting press-ons instead of acrylic? I'm going to do it um this weekend. Possibly. Why are you asking? What do you mean, why am I asking? Or should I do dark champagne? They kind of look alike in the freaking camera. Con que limpias las brayas. Um, con acetona. Hold on, Amy. I'm not sure if you guys can tell the difference on the camera because they kind of look very similar. But this one has a little bit more yellow than that one. Light gold or dark champagne. Dark champagne. Hi, Letty. I was just thinking about you today, Letty. Text me your address, girl, so I can send me your baby clothes. How's your belly? You said you're going to do what you want. Yeah, te olvidaste. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> but this time for real, I do want your your advice. No, I can't see the difference. Light gold, dark, dark champagne, dark champagne, champagne. Hi, light gold. Oh my god, it's a tie already. It's a tie, light. All right, the next person who comments light gold, mix them light. Oh my Lord, it's a tie. I guess we're going with light gold. Okay, Letty, which one should I do? Light gold or dark champagne? Letty, where are you? Dark champagne. I will. Belly's big and I'm ready, but doesn't seem like he is. Oh, man. Ooh, it looks like the light gold is winning. Letty. Dark. Okay. We're going to go with dark champagne. Only because Letty said it and she's pregnant. So the baby said dark champagne. So let's see. We're going to go with dark champagne. Or maybe I'll do one and one. Let's see which one looks better. Let me... Ooh, which one's which? Dark champagne. All right, let me get some... Let me mix it up a little bit. How would it look one and one? Yeah, I'm going to... I want to see what that's going to look like. Mix, mix, mix. Mix it up. Mix it up. All right. Let me put it here. Can you post a reel when you put your press-ons, please? Of course, girl. Why do you think I'm making these press-ons? I got to post it. I have to post it. What the fuck are my nails? They disappeared. <sighs> they disappeared in... Ooh. I'm going to do it on this one. Okay. Ya están listas, mijas? Ya están listas para el dark champagne? Medium rose champagne, actually. So I'm just going to go around the little outline. And you could you could even squiggle your own little things if you want to squiggle, squiggle, squiggle. It doesn't have to be straight. Or even a little bling would be nice here. You know, a little squiggling like it's a rip paper or something. Yes, honey. Work that little squiggle. Oh, my Lord. Girl, that looks so beautiful. Oh, my God. You know what? I'm going to put the other gold one down here. You know, two types of gold, bitch. So beautiful. So beautiful. Oh, I let the hair grow mas. Come on, like gold. Sácalo, sácalo. Parece culebrita. Okay, okay. Are y'all ready to see this light gold? A ver, a ver, a ver. Contour. Me encanta tu trabajo. Gracias. Girl, I don't know how to contour. I don't do my makeup. Ooh, that still looks really nice. I don't even know which one looks nicer. They're both fucking beautiful. Wow. 
The light gold is like a little shade lighter than the champagne gold. They're so beautiful, both of them. But if I had to choose, let me see. Let me pull it away from the light. I kind of like the champagne gold better. It's a tough one. Bellissima. It's so cute. All right, let me put this here. I'm going to outline the little Frenchies. Severmoso. I like the light. What? You like the light one? I'm going to do one Frenchie of each. You know, ya que ya le puse los dos. So. Let me outline it. I like the bottom. You like the lighter one? I like the dark one. Good thing I did both. No más que no puedo hablar a la verga cuando estoy aquí pintando, you know? The dark champagne. Yeah, that's the one that was my fave. But then, I don't know, I'll be liking dark shit lately. Oh my God, I got it on my nail. It's so sexy. And um, these gels, they're no wipe. So if you were to do the nail matte or whatever, um, you don't have to put a top coat on them. You have gotten so good with the liner, girl, right? I think por eso I've been, like, doing it more because I feel a little bit more confident. Like, yes, bitch. I could draw now. I could draw a line. Ya me creo. O sea, antes no podía ni pintar una pinche raya. Y ahora mírale, mírame chueca, pero ahí sale. Do you prefer nail art or rhinestones on your nails? Girl, rhinestones all the way. But here and there, I like a little simplicity, you know, aka these. Like, these are really simple. Pretty simple for me. Like, they're simple in the sense where there's not a lot of bling on these two. This one has the most bling. And then this one has, like, the little nail art and then boom, bling. But if you were to just look at these four, they're simple for a basic person, you know? You could always take this bling away and it's still cute, like simple. And then boom, bring in the thumb. <sighs> You're never simple. This is my simple, okay? If I ever say simple, just know that that's what you're going to expect to see. Something like that. I think that's why some of my clients be a little nervous when... I'd be like, come on, bitch, let me freestyle you or whatever. Um, <laughs> your husband says, que me creo. Um, fuck, I forgot what I was saying. I fucking hate when that happens. You know, like you're over here trying to read multitasking shit. Really, I get bored of rhinestones. I prefer nail art. Ayer me dibujé la Betty Boop. Oh, pues. Once I get to that level, girl, where I could drop Betty Boop and shit, or Kirby, or El Goku, or whatever, then maybe I'll like nail art better. Right now, I'm having fun, because I can't really draw much. But I love the bling. I just love sparkly shit. That's what I love, the sparkles. I need to have them in my life, at least a little. A simple freestyle, everyone knows you're simple. Mm-hmm. Yeah, por eso me, some of my clients be scared of me because some a lot of my clients are simple as fuck. Like one of my clients, she was getting married, right? And she was not going to get no bling. She was planning on not getting any bling, okay? And I'm like, uh, 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 uh no girl, you ain't leaving here without no bling. Even if I have to regalártelo, how are you going to get married with no bling? Mm. No, not gonna happen. 
And then she's like, okay, I'll get some bling. And she was already going to start choosing the smallest diamonds. I'm like, uh, 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 uh. you know what? Just close your eyes, girl. Go close your eyes. Let me do this design for you. Free on the house, girl. Porque no. Uno, cuando tienes clientes simples, you gotta pressure them a little sometimes. Aunque se estén muriendo por dentro. Like, oh my God. Pinche diamantón, mamón. Me va a la lagreña, la verga. Tú pon el pinche diamond. What are you doing, girlfriend? What you mixing? What do you mean? And what am I mixing? I was cleaning my brush. So whenever, oh shit. Whenever your brush is stiff, like when you're changing colors or whatever, if your brush is ever stiff a little bit, just put it in clear, a clear, 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 um, top coat like wiggle the bristles and um how to call it say se como se dice no importa in the lamp it it separates them kind of like mascara you know like when you have your eyelashes all stuck together and you know it's going a little bristle and they separate like that I'm gonna start doing that. And andale, hay que ponerte poquita Swarovski. Mm hmm. See, sí, it's cause you gotta be like a drug dealer. You gotta give them a little freebie and then they're gonna get hooked. Eh, just kidding. I mean, it doesn't always work, but sometimes it's okay to give your clients, your friends, or whatever, something free. Because, um, a little appreciation, you know? And also because you don't want your fucking feet to look hella simple, just one color. Like, girl, let me put your flower. Y luego a la misma vez, you get to practice that one thing that you're putting on them for free, you know? If it's free, they ain't gonna complain. Trust me. It's rare the bitch that will complain when there's something free. Like, oh, I know, you know? How long have you been doing nails? Um, According to my Facebook, I saw that I was going to school 10 years ago. I went to my first class ever and but like as a career it's gonna be eight years it's not it's already been eight years I lose track already or maybe it's gonna be nine years I don't know I have to look at my license oh my god do you recommend the Mia Secret Glue Activator for your bling adhesive? Yes, ma'am. That's the only thing you should be using. I'm just kidding. You could use whichever activator. You could use whatever activator. They all work as long as it dries glue. All right. Ahora sí, el bling bling. Hay que sacar el bling bling. Your license just came in the mail? Yes. I don't have that much gold bling. That's kind of like the vibe I want to put. Okay, bitch. You know that sueñito. gold the gold champagne or whatever i don't really have too much in this color did my thing fall asleep all right hold on guys my lamp me está quedando mal aquí no se prendió la way all right so i'll probably put like a little shape and some round ones i should probably move these ginormous ones out the way 
Algo medio simple, buchón. How do you deal with people that get used to getting free designs that when you want to charge them, they get mad? Um, to be honest, just don't care. Just You have to not give them free shit all the time either, okay? Just let them know. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry. You have to let them know, okay? I'm going to give you a free design this time. You're not going to give it to them all the time. If they're expecting it, it's because you do it too often. You need to stop. You need to stop that because the longer you let that fly, the more and more they're going to get used to it. And one of these days, they're going to be so mad. They're not going to pay you because it happened to me. They're not going to want to pay you. They're going to want to be like, oh, it's a little bit mad. Oh, don't believe them. Don't believe them. Um, or they're just not going to come back no more. And it's totally fine. Good night, beautiful. It was wonderful watching your work for the first time. Good night, the um, diamond. And it's totally fine. <sighs> if they be getting mad or whatever. Because if this is your full-time job, you cannot be giving out free shit all the time. You got to get paid. You have bills to pay. Here and there, it's nice to give a little freebie, but not forever. They cannot get used to it. All right, so this is what we have going on. Let me put them in order. Um... This is the thumb, this is the index finger, the middle finger, the pinky. Um, let me fix this one real quick. Let me file the side a little bit. No manches, está bien lumpy. Está bien lumpy, no me dicen, está chonky. What do you have the nails on? They are on a um, press-on thingy. <sighs> so, just a little bit more. I should have done this earlier, but me pasé. Me pasé, Nico. This is why I don't do press-ons, porque I can't even hold them. So, if y'all do press-ons, shift. I don't know how you do it, girl. I don't know. I would fucking flip the fuck out like this set will be over a hundred dollars because it's stressing me out and it's only five nails i got accepted for nail tech school starting in april but got to get the financials in order so doing press-ons in the meantime i do free for practice only in family and friends okay girl as long as it's temporary and not forever free is good for practice only Or until you get good, you know? That's how you get your experience. Oh, you wait. All right. All righty. Let's bedazzle them. Well, I'm not going to put too much bling because they're supposed to be fancy. Um, I'm going to do this one. All right. Let's get the bling bling. I'm going to be using my Zule Bling Adhesive for the little bedazzles. Mm. Where's my little pen? You did press-ons for a while and gave up? Why, girl? Why did you give up? Tell us. Tell us your experience. 
How did it go? Why did you give up? What made you give up? Best adhesive out there, period. Mm hmm Okay. Ooh. I'm over here like, it's going to be simple. Boom. Big as bling. The biggest one in the box. Let's see. Hold on. I've been doing nails for about two and a half years now. I'm sorry. After COVID hit, I've been having trouble growing my clientele. I sometimes think if I should get models to have them promote me with their friends, etc. I feel so lost and stuck, sad right now. Love your glue game changer. Yo quiero uno para colgarme el molcajete. <laughs> yes. Actually, this one is not Swarovski. This one is Preciosa, the big one. No, girl, don't give up. Sometimes you have to... Um, take a little step back and see like what's going on. But I mean, if you would need to um take some models, do it. Pero también keep in mind that some of these people are gonna say that they are gonna promote you, but they're not. I'm telling you from experience because back in the day when I would give out free nails. Um, I used to do promotions like in my Facebook and shit, like I'll do raffles and normally the people that would win my raffles, they'd get a free set. They never fucking came back. They just came for the free and that's it. They never came to spend a dime with me. Maybe it was because my nails were ugly. I don't know. I mean, I didn't think they were, but just think about it. Just post on social media and wear your nails. That's the best, the best promotion you can do for yourself. I'm going to add a little bit of balls, half balls. The one thing that I hate about doing fucking bling on gel polish, Lord, como se mueven, me caen rete gordas. Like right here, they're stressing me out already. This is why I need it to be on acrylic. Normally, I buff the area. Like if I'm doing it on a climb, mira, pa donde vas, pa donde vas, hija de perra. Look at these bitches lighting off. I buff the area, but. Oh my God. Bitch, where are you going? I don't want to buff anything. I'll buff the next nail so you guys can see the difference. So, si quieren que se les seque rápido su pinche glue, miren. Nomás echenle activator. Y se seca. Casi, ay, ya se secó el güey. No manches. Pinche bling chueco. Oh, fuck. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. You know what? Hold on. I should have just buffed it since the beginning. Mm -mm -mm. Hold on. Let me take this off. Just buff it, girls. Don't be lazy like me. And just buff the little section where you think you're going to put the bling. And then you can always put top coat around it. So um, I'm just going to put bling like down the middle. So that's what I'm going to buff. I think sometimes it's helpful when you have a circle of people that inspire and encourage you, but rarely ever go out. I'm starting to slowly network and your work and really help inspire me. Uh, girl, I don't got no friends or nothing like that. I do not go out. I'm a homebody, but I try to come on here to motivate some people because shit, I wish I had a Zule in my life when I was younger. 
Excuse me. All right, hold on. There's a little bit of glue still here, so let me buff that off. What do we put a matte top coat? A matte top coat. It's still not gonna stick good. They both don't. They stay slippery. That's why I hate gel sometimes. Okay, that's enough. I guess this was educational purpose after all. There's still a little bit of glue, but I'll cover that. I'll cover that right now. I guess baby Jesus is the one with to use the big ones. I'll use the dolls. The smaller ones. Okay, let's start over. We have organic nails, but their stuff is expensive. Yeah, I used to use organic actually when I started doing nails. Um, that shit was pretty expensive, but it was the good good, the good good shit. It was kind of hard for us to find it too. Well, at least for me. Before. Okay. Ahí vamos. Otra vez. Let me put. No problem. No problem. Let me put a little flame. Look, see how they're not like moving too much no more? They're still not dry, but um, they're not moving all over no more. All right, I'm gonna put this one, this ball. This one is like a full round caviar bead. So normally these fall off and slide off the nails, but right now that i buffed the area see how it dried faster so if you want it to if you want your bling to dry faster then just apply directly to your acrylic or um file your your top coat a little bit i know in the beginning sometimes when you're a beginner you need all the time in the world but Shit, I need my shit to dry fast. Yo me desespero la verga. Okay, so I'm gonna do just a little, a little design. Just a little bit. I don't know why, but I've been into balls lately, like these caviar balls. They remind me of back in the day, so I guess that's why I be using them. Back in the day. Zule, does your top coat require alcohol wipe? No. No, none of my top coats require that. I hate that. I'm trying to make your life easier, not extra steps. Ooh, ooh, honey, so cute. My fucking eyes hurt. Okay, I'm gonna add one more ball. One more bola. You do a little bit of glue at a time. I think I know where I'm fucking up on my bling. Yes, you, that's what you got to do. Little at a time. Small sections because it will dry. Sometimes it dries fast. Sometimes it dries slow. You just don't know. You never know. Hmm. I'm going to have enough little ones to go all the way down. I'm over here saying que van a ser simple and look at me planning to go all the way down. All the way down. A ver si me sale Twix. And 
Ándale, bling, bling. Que al cabo que nadie te va a usar uñas. Tú échale el bling, bling. I received my order today. It's late. Thank you so much. I can't wait to try your acrylics. Yeah. Just make sure to hold them in your brush, girl. Because right now in the cold, it be lagging. It be lagging to dry. Doing Shang Hang Lu. Oh my god, I have to go to work tomorrow. I don't want to go to work. Well, I do want to go to work. I just don't want to drive. I wish I had like a a fucking jet. How do I soften up the bling gel? It's literally the best gel, and there is there is in my opinion, but mine hardened. If it got hard, hard, you need another one. How long you had it for? You have to be careful also when you use activator because if you contaminate your bottle, it will fucking get hard. <clears throat> Once the gel gets hard, there's no way in turning it back. I wish there was a way, but there isn't. Um. So what do you do with the nails that you practice on? I keep them. I said that I was going to make them into like a little book or put them on a wall or some shit. But I haven't done that. I keep them in a little box. I'm saving my designs. For inspo later. I think I'm doing it crooked. A year? Oh, no, no, no. Rhea. A year? Oh my lord, you lucky it's been around that long, girl. You need a new one. Honey, 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 honey. I'm sorry if my bling is going to the side, but so is my body. My body is going sideways. Valio pura verga, my simple, okay? All right, I'm going to spray the activator on the side. And let me grab my next nail. Oh, shit. This one is going to be more bedazzled. I just found a bottle in my old suitcase from about six or seven years ago. And Marta Chavez told me about your bling glue. Girl, I haven't had it that long. Do you do your own acrylics or do you... Do press-ons for yourself. No, I do my own acrylic nails. I actually did them yesterday. But I'm just doing these like for fun. Like all Swarovskis, you put on those nails and is the good. You oh, wait, what the fuck did I do? Like all Swarovskis, you put on those nails. You don't feel like you can use cheap ones and use the good ones on your clients. Um, yeah, normally to practice or to do like little designs, I do uh, both, but I feel like I might use these more than I think I am. So that's why I'm putting Swarovski's, but not nah, fuck my clients. She, I'm nah, just kidding. They don't wear bling. Oh no. I forgot to buff the nail. Yeah, I've, I've had my glue for five years, I believe. No, no, no. F five or four years. All right, so let me spray this. So it can stop moving. Okay.
Don't do what I just did. Buff your nail. Do you reuse your rhinestones on yourself? No, never. Never, never, never. I never reuse my bling. I used to back in the day, but not no more. Uh-uh. I need the new, the new, new. I need the whole, the whole new bedazzle. So right here, since I sprayed activator on my nail, whatever glue I put on is going to freeze instantly. Oh, shit. Don't do that to your clients. Give it time to like evaporate. I did it on this nail because it's a practice now. But look at me having to fix it because. Did you guys hear that? It jumped. It jumped. See? It dried too fast. It dried way too fast for me. Ya voló a la verga somewhere else. Like, I don't got patience right now. Bling. Don't test me. Hasta mañana. Descansar. Ya voy a terminar aquí. Ya me voy a ir a dormir yo también. Pero primero hay que terminar estas uñitas. Para subirlas al Instagram. Para subirlas al Insta, Instagram. I should have just left my nails simple. Pero no. No puedo. No puedo ser simple. Girl, you just have to practice doing your non-dominant hand. Um, every time that you do it, it's just going to get easier. But it's still hard. I've been doing my nails, my opposite hand, for 10 years now. Since I was practicing to do nails. And girl, let me tell you, I still struggle. But I could do a lot more now to them. You just have to do them. Like before, oh my God, I would hate filing and stuff like that. I mean, I still hate that part, but um, I do it better. You learn writing with your left hand? I only do three clients a day. Sometimes four clients, but excuse me. I normally do only three because I take a long time. I take two to three hours with every client. And if their nails are really long and detailed, shit, that could take even four or five hours. It just depends on what I'm doing. Like something like this would definitely take me at least four hours because of the flowers and all of that. Let me put top coat on this one again. Because I buffed it earlier. Oop. Oop. Honey. So, yo si me tardo. Oh, wrong now. Super cute. <coughs> I wait. I take a day off when my nails getting done. Okay, girl. You smart. Because you don't want to, you don't want to be rushing your nail, lady. I like when my clients, thank you, thank you. I like when my clients take their time off from work too. Like, oh, I got the whole day. Like, yes, girl. I mean, I ain't trying to be with you all day because I got other people. But it's nice to know that they're not going to be rushing, you know. Yes, girl, because ain't nobody interrupting my appointment. Uh, <laughs> for real. It's like beauty day. My clients normally, they go get their eyebrows, their pedicure, 
all their beauty stuff. They're gonna get extra beautiful. And then with those nails, they're gonna start talking with their hands and all that. My kids better catch a lift. You're funny. She, they better walk their asses. Fuck the lift, cause I need that money for my nails. <laughs> Adios, buenas noches. Son las, un, es las una. Oh my lord. Vete a dormir, honey. Ya terminamos aquí las uñitas. Nunca se te ha ido una sin pagar. Claro que sí. Ya me pasó dos veces y no me vuelve a pasar. Sí, y fue las que menos me... Menos pensé que me iban a hacer eso. So don't ever let nobody walk out of your workroom. Um... How to call it without pain because they are not going to pay your ass no matter how close to you they are. As a matter of fact, me ha pasado tres veces. Tres veces. No, I don't own my own nail spot. I rent in a salon. I rent a room in a hair salon. And I need them long. I'm not a sixth grade or, or a librarian. <laughs> Do you own... Oh, wait, because these aren't $40 nails. Mm -mm. What music do you listen to when doing nails? I listen to Spanish music like Corridos or like Grupo Firme. My kids better catch a lid. Oh, wait, I haven't read that. Can you do a tutorial on dark flower, please? On a dark... On the dark flower? I just showed you guys how to do it. I'm going to save this video for my YouTube channel. So if you don't follow me on YouTube, make sure to go follow me, Zulace Nails, because I'm going to be posting this video there. Oh my God, no way. How did you react towards them? Did they try coming back after not paying you? Hell no, they fucking didn't try it. So the first person who did me dirty like that, she was actually a relative. Not my relative, but it's still in the family. She died like... She'll be like, oh, I'm going to pay you. I'm going to go get my wallet. She never came. She was hiding from me for a good minute until I stopped asking for the money. But I still remember. You owe me, girl. And then the other two, once they didn't pay me, like, they'd be ignoring me. No, they never fucking came back. I wouldn't accept their asses back either. Fuck that. Do you know dónde yo puedo conseguir el libro que trae los uñas en blanco para nosotros hacer el diseño? Sí, se llama mylittleblackbook.com. All right, so these are the nails. Let me put them down here. These were today's tutorial. Ay, les tengo que quitar el chicle que traen ahí atrás. I'm just kidding. It's not chicle. I could never do that. My nail girl is my bebecita. I've been with her tres años. Girl, well, let me tell you. My first client ever. The one client that I had for a few years. I don't even know how long I have been doing nails when she did me dirty. But she was my first client ever. I want to say I was with her for at least three years also. She was the one that did me dirty. It was her. That's why I never expected it. So that's why I don't trust nobody. All right. There they are. But yes. Would your cool be? Uh, what would your cool be? On a set like this. Mm, well, these, first of all, are not acrylic. So if they were acrylic, for starting price for short nails, it would be over $100 for this design. So, 
so gorgeous, like 120 and up. Do you ask for, hold on. Uh, let's see. I had a Fashion Nova girl say she was going to PayPal me when her phone charged up again. And then a few days later when I asked, I shouted you out. Pinche perra caca con elote. Y se me... <laughs> what the fuck? Do you ask for half of the money up front? Um, after these incidents that happened to me as a beginner, I started taking deposits. Now... I don't really take new clients because my regulars take up most of my schedule. But when I do take them here and there, I ask for at least a $50 deposit because uh -uh, if they don't show up, I'm about to lose my day. <clears throat> ¿Qué número es el color rojo? Es um, 122. Sí. 122. Es el nuevo que apenas subí hoy. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully by tomorrow or Saturday or Sunday, my regular page is unblocked and we can hang out over there. Good night, everyone. Bye.